Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a requested one. I've kind of mentioned doing this and I had a lot of feedback that y'all wanted to see a skincare routine video. So if you've clicked on this video, you've seen my before picture. When I, when we decided we wanted to get pregnant, came off of birth control and my skin, just the mixture of coming off of birth control and then getting pregnant, my hormones, went absolutely insane my skin went insane it was very stressful it was a happy time because i was pregnant but at the same time that like month or so in between coming off and getting pregnant i won't say i was depressed but if you've ever had acne you know that it really affects your mood and how you feel about yourself and anyone out there that is dealing with acne right now I know where you are, I know how you feel, it's the most frustrating thing in the world, but I'm going to share my routine with you all. I did tons of research because if you're pregnant, you have to be very careful about what products you use on your skin, just because certain things can affect your baby and you just have to be very careful with certain chemicals and things. So I did tons and tons of research and I wanted to use products that were cleaner and i just wanted a good routine that i could stick to and that would obviously clear up my skin and also be something that i can do long term so i'm going to go through my products that i used started using when i found out i was pregnant and then i still use the exact same routine it's been my baby's two months old so it's been right at a year since i started this routine and i love all these products and i'm going to show you all of them i will have everything linked down below as well so i'm going to check any of these out just click down below in the notes and you can see them there. So before I get started, um, if you're new here, my name's Lindsay. I am a new mom. My baby just turned two months old and we're just having so much fun with her. It's like the best thing ever. And um, yeah, I have lots of mom videos on my channel and trying to navigate what I want this next year to look like video wise. Um, so if you have any suggestions comment those down below but yes if you're new here hi and if you do like this video and it's helpful to you um click the like button down below and always feel free to subscribe if you want to stick around okay so let's get into these products i'll start with the basic products first and i'll go through exactly how i do my routine so um i'm going to wash my face first thing i'm going to use is this full lane balancing cleanser and i found this brand just from someone on instagram i heard them talking about how clean this brand was so i did my research i looked at their page and read about them and i just really fell in love with this brand so their balance and cleanser and this is for oil control it's for combination to oily skin so it's like a it's a black cleanser i think it has some charcoal in it but love this and all their products are oil free non-toxic cruelty free vegan gluten free non-gmo and dermatologist tested so really liked products um from their line so i've used this cleanser like i said for a year now absolutely love it so i use this first thing morning and night i use this cleanser and then i follow up with just the thayer's um witch hazel and i just use a carton pad and kind of tone my face with this and I do this morning and night as well. And then after that, I'll start with my morning routine first. So those two things I do morning and night, but then I only use this product in the mornings. And it's because I don't wanna mix with another product I use at night. And I'll explain that here in a second. But this is the Ordinary Niacinamide and Zinc Serum. And I will say before I go any further, any of these products, check with your doctor. If you are pregnant, check with your doctor before you start using them. My doctor cleared everything, but there could be a reason why your doctor doesn't want you to use some of this. So just make sure you always check with your doctors before actually using it. So niacinamide and zinc, this is really good for like acne scarring, kind of helps brighten the skin and just get rid of hyperpigmentation and things like that. So I know zinc is really good for your skin as well. Um, 
so yeah love this stuff i use this only in the mornings and at night this is the only step i do different at morning and night so this is morning after i tone this is night after i tone this product is like one of my favorite things ever the i don't know how to pronounce the brand quadly maybe this is the vino pure skin perfecting serum and i actually found this serum from another youtuber i cannot remember who it was but when i was pregnant i was digging through youtube trying to find some content on what worked for people that were pregnant what skincare worked to clear acne i watched tons of videos and it's basically why i'm making this video because i feel like there needs to be more out there on what actually worked and especially for pregnant people pregnant women because it's so hard to like there's so much skincare out there so it's hard to know what to use but this does have a salicylic acid in it it's a natural salicylic acid but some doctors will say not to use this while you're pregnant so again check with your doctor but my doctor told me i could use this starting in my second trimester so i did not use this first trimester but i did start second trimester so i use just one pump of this at night and it's very thin it's a very thin consistency and i just kind of press it into my face and it's called skin perfecting and i swear it does that it gets in your pores and i feel like it really clears out your pores and just kind of dries dries up anything that you have going on so i really really like this i have bought so many bottles of this i never want to run out because it's so good if i go like a day without using it i almost freak out but love this so much check out their website i'll link it down below like i said and i'll link this exact one but this stuff i swear by this this is like one of the biggest parts i think of my routine that helped actually clear everything up and kept it clear so love this and then after those two things i use folin's mattifying moisturizer and I started out using a different moisturizer from Folane, but I didn't like it. And I went to this one. This is for oil control and for combination to oily skin. So this one kind of pairs well with that cleanser that I use. But this stuff's really great too. I just love the consistency. It's done wonders for me. And I also will say Folane's products are pretty cheap they're not super expensive so that's another reason I like them they use it's like really basic containers for their products so it doesn't feel like super expensive when you get it but the contents is the only thing that matters um, so you're not paying for like expensive packaging and things like that but love all of their stuff so I use this after those products and then I also use full lanes eye cream so this is their firm and brightening eye cream and this is for all skin types the stuff is great i use it morning and night just right under my eyes and up on my lid i didn't always use an eye cream this is actually the first one i've consistently used and i've loved it i'm a new mom so i know i need something for under eyes because yeah the sleep I knew it was going to be rocky, but this has worked great so far. I love the consistency of this too. I just use a tiny little dab and this lasts me. It's a smaller container, but it lasts me so, so long. And then last thing in my routine, this is the Polish Choice Benzoyl Peroxide Treatment. And this is another product that you want to check with your doctor on. Um, this is only 2.5% benzoyl peroxide, so most doctors will say this is fine for pregnancy. It's just when you get up into the higher percentages where it's iffy. But this is also a really well-priced product, and I saw lots of good reviews and things on their website and on YouTube about this. But I spot treat with this, so I put this on places where... I usually break out or if I have a breakout I put it on there and usually on my chin maybe on my cheeks some and yeah I just love this stuff this is regular strength I think they have a maximum strength which is like maybe 10% so if you are pregnant I would recommend looking at their regular strength instead but this is the first bottle I bought and it has lasted me so long just because I don't have to use a ton of it but love this for spot treatments and then the very last thing that I use is Aquaphor and I use this as a lip balm 
every night I just put it on my lips and it's so good. I wake up and my lips feel amazing. I know a lot of people use this on their skin. I've not tried that out yet, but I might. But this is great for using a chapstick. If you've never used it, try it. It's amazing. So just to recap everything, because I kind of ran through that really quick. To recap, my morning routine is the Balance and Cleanser, the Toner, the Niacinamide from The Ordinary, Moisturizer, Eye Cream, and then Aquaphor on my lips. And then for nighttime, I use all these same things except for The Ordinary, and I replace with the Skin Perfecting Serum. So that is my skincare routine that has been cleaner for me and was pregnancy safe that I did basically my whole pregnancy minus the skin perfecting serum during the first trimester but if you have any questions leave them down below and i'll be happy to answer but like i said everything is linked down below if you are pregnant or watching this video and you have some advice on products that you've used definitely comment those down below just for anyone that's clicking through on this video looking for advice i know that'll be helpful to other people out there so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye